Hello YouTube, GamerKid1989 here with another video this week. Um, it's been a while. Kind of busy again. Um, work stuff and the weekend I was pretty busy as well because well it was just so dang nice out. It still is really nice and real calm. About 70 degrees. Perfect weather. smoking my <clears throat> I don't know what figure this is it's like a uh, I want to say it was like Lincoln or something but it doesn't look like Lincoln this is my bearded pipe smoker pipe my mirror pipe in it I have some Captain Black Dark I believe it's called um, pack this right out of the tin, so, well, not out of the tin, out of the jar, so, didn't want to dry out, so it's a little bit wet. The nice thing about this pipe, it smokes nice and cool. Bought this new on, uh, eBay back when I was first getting into pipes. It just doesn't got a whole lot of color yet. It's got that little bit down there, but the rest of it is pretty uh, pretty white yet. It does have some kind of uh, engraving in the bottom. I don't know what that's if that's a signature or what that is, um, but that's what's on the bottom of it, so I don't know. Just figured I'd hop on here and kind of tell you guys what I've been up to. It was Sunday night. I actually went through all my pipes with some um, Bacardi 151, ran it through the stems. Um, some of the bowls that were pretty gross got some of those reamed out. So it should be all set to go. Also, um, as I was doing that, I kind of had some pipes sitting in a tub that I really, really smoked. Um, well, I, I smoked back when I first started, but some of them I haven't smoked for a while. Um, and I have uh, two pipe stands. Um, one is a, I think they both hold 12. One is six across, six across, kind of a, a long pipe on each side. And the other one is a turntable, Lazy Susan type thing with a tobacco jar in the middle. So I went through and I kind of sorted those out, put the ones on the stand that I smoke. Um, the other ones went kind of back in the tub for now until I find a use for them. Um, maybe it'll be some bang around pipes soon, sometime. Love the way this pipe smokes. <clears throat> smokes real well. Um, my only thing is, I like to grab down here by the beard, and I, I know it's going to mess up the coloring on it, but it's just, you know, how it is. Still haven't got around to uh, smoking on the go yet. I just haven't had time to sit down and go over things and a pipe out somewhere, but I don't know where it's at. I gotta find that yet. A lot of my pipe stuff when I when I moved to this apartment got 
it's kind of thrown all over because I wasn't sure you know what room was going where or what things were going in which room and I think the pipe boxes just got scattered all the rooms and they really just got thrown in a pile in the, in the closet somewhere and that's where they sat for a while. Also, uh, I've been thinking about, um, as I said, I, you know, I went through my pipes and with some pipe cleaners and stuff, but at uh, my old house, I have a uh, buffer. And to buy any uh, the wheels, the cloth wheels or whatever, and the compound, I think there's three compounds and wax or something like that so I think I got four wheels and then I have that mounted on an old uh, half horsepower uh, GE old electric motor that was used for a rock saw by my grand my grandpa been trying to figure out a way to bring that over here I can do in the daytime, so can I have a, you know, of course we have like a noise thingy at, at night, so that wouldn't be an option, but at least during the day, I can bring it out here, that way I'm not throwing dust all over the house, because I wouldn't want that, um, bring out here, the only problem is, is uh, this deck, or patio, or whatever, it's made of metal, um, it's got metal post, metal floor, metal rails, everything's metal. Um, even the siding it's connected to is metal. So I'm thinking it's going to make a lot of noise, a lot of vibration, and that metal's going to be real noisy. So i got to figure out that yet. It might not come here. Maybe I'll just bring my pipes over there when I'm at my dad's house and do them then, or something, you know, because they don't take too long just to polish them up quick. If I got a pipe I got to work on, I can bring it over there every day and spend a, some time on it. I'm waiting for this thing to get some color in it. I guess I haven't smoked it too much, but I'm waiting. I wonder how, how cool these pipes smoke. Um, how much... I don't think they mute the flavor as much, but they it, they seem to kind of take some out. Um, but they make the, the smoke real nice. It's actually nice with this uh, Captain Black Dark. Um, it actually takes a lot of the... <clears throat> I think sometimes that can get overly sweet, so uh, that takes some of the uh, I think real sweet stuff out of it. Mix it, uh, an alright tobacco. Got to figure out something with my camera. I got to order a new battery or something because I'm looking at it. I started it had uh, 50 minutes on the battery life, and now it's at 15 minutes, and I've only been recording nine, so. That's what happens when you let stuff sit in a drawer and not use it. Especially the batteries, they get real bad real quick. The batteries are usually pretty cheap nowadays. Like, for that kind of stuff. Anyhow. seen the uh, international well, cop foolery is uh, over votes were put in for that and checked out the, uh, some of the winners cops and some nice looking cops I really like that uh, that gourd calabash that's real neat uh, I think it was an amateur or maybe it was a pro I'm not sure 
Um, but it was a real nice pipe regardless. I'd like to get a... That's one pipe that I haven't... Uh, well, I guess I have one, but it's not a real mer uh, Meerschaum bowl. It's a porcelain bowl. It was a real cheap one. And it you know, doesn't smoke very well. It's cool, but that porcelain's so heavy. It's like trying to freaking hold like a five-pound weight in your mouth. Not that heavy, but, you know. Not too much else going on, I guess. Probably won't get time again today to do that, but we'll see how far how far I get right now. I'm cooking some, well, getting ready to cook some dinner. I got some, I'm going to try to make some black beans and rice, uh, chicken and stuff, so. Sorry, I had some people walk over here. I didn't want to be too noisy. Um, so anyway, uh, we'll see what I uh, what I get through tonight. That with that beans, and, you know, you gotta soak them. I did the quick soak. You just throw them in a pan for an hour and boil uh, boil them, and then you just throw them off the heat for an hour. That way, they get you don't have to do the eight hour soak, and then. Uh, Got them cooking now for a couple hours, and I gotta get the rice going. And... So I guess I'll let you guys go. I don't have too much else to say. Um, hope everyone's enjoying their hopefully nice weather. I know, uh, like I said, here we've had almost a week straight of very, very nice weather. You know, a few rain showers here and there, but nice and you know, kind of cool. Not too windy. Um, nice weather. Alright, so I'll uh, go ahead and take off. Say uh, 73s, as my dad would say, to uh, all the pipe smokers. And uh, hope everyone has a great week.